Hey guys, I've missed making videos for you so much. I've been busy traveling, so I thought it would be a great opportunity to film and show you what nail care and nail art supplies I take with me when I travel. I'm actually off to LA today because I'll be attending BeautyCon on Saturday. If you're going, I'd love to see you. I'll be having a meet and greet from 1 to 2 p.m. with Style Hall. But for now, let's get into what I carry with me when I'm traveling and I know I'll want to be doing some fun nail art. The first thing I always make sure to bring with me is a little tin of Burt's Bees Lemon Butter Cuticle Cream. Now, you guys have heard me rave about this before, but it's still my number one favorite nail care product because it works wonders on my nails and softens my cuticles. Next, I have this little tool that removes cuticles from my local drugstore. However, I don't use it for that. I use it solely for removing hangnails from the sides of my nails. It quickly and painlessly gets rid of dead skin with a single swipe. I like to do this so hangnails don't get caught and ripped. Up next, a travel-sized bottle of my favorite hand lotion. This is the OPI Avo Juice and they come in a bunch of different scents. This stuff is awesome because it absorbs really fast and it doesn't leave my hands feeling greasy, although it does leave them feeling super soft. I also like to throw in a tiny four-sided nail buffer. This one's from Sephora and it allows you to file, buff, smooth, and give shine on the go. Although for the filing, I prefer to bring and use my crystal nail file. Again, you can find them at your local drugstore. Crystal files are lovely for your nails and they help keep them strong even when filing because they're so gentle. For a dotting tool, I like to bring along this tiny travel sized one from Sally Hansen. I think it's so cute. The Sally Hansen kit that this came in also comes with a tiny paintbrush for detailing work. And it also comes with a striping brush for lines. This is great for traveling because then you don't have to bring along striper polishes. I also like to throw in a makeup sponge in case I want to create an ombre or a gradient. I've been loving these studs from Sally Hansen's I Heart Nail Art line and it comes in a cute travel friendly case so I've been bringing this along with me as well. And you can't forget your fast drying top coat and a protective base coat. Unfortunately I don't have travel sized bottles of these. I'm not even sure if they make them but they really should. For my polishes, I love to bring mini ones to save space. A great tip is to plan out which nail art designs you'll be doing on your trip so you can just bring the specific colors you need. Finally, I've been using these Formula X Delete to Go Remover Wipes from Sephora. The wipes are very saturated and do a great job at removing polish. I guess I'll demonstrate it for you, because you're my bae and I love you more than my manny. <laughs> So there you go! I like to carry all of these things in a little zippered bag. This one is from Sephora and I love the color and the stitching on it. Also, it's the perfect size for travel. If you're going on a plane and you have your polishes and checked baggage, it's important to wrap them in bubble wrap. Finally, I pack it all into my little bag. And there you have it, my essentials that I like to bring with me when I'm on a trip that I know I'll want to be doing some nail art, which is pretty much every trip I go on. What are your nail art travel essentials? Let me know down in the comments. Take care, and I'll see you next time!